What's going on YouTube? It's Megs from Megs Loves Bananas and I am finally getting to my comparison video of the SGP Neo Hybrid EX series cases. Um, if you didn't see my video on this case, I'll put an annotation there. This is the fake SGP case that I picked up in Hong Kong for about um, 10 bucks, I would say. Um, and this is the real SGP um, Neo Hybrid EX case that SGP sent me. If you haven't seen the unboxing video for this case, I'll put an annotation there. So this video is a comparison um, of the fake and the real. Now, I'm going to go through the packaging, I'm going to go through the case. I've got um, my real iPhone and my fake iPhone, um, conveniently, so that I can review these cases on the phone. There are some similarities, but they definitely are very different cases. As you can see from the packaging, the companies did a great job um, on making this look like SGP packaging. Um, right down to the, the plastic and everything, it feels and looks um, exactly the same. Um, this is the fake one. You can see the color is a little bit, um, oh no, that's the real one. The color is a little bit brighter. Um, you can see the shading in here a bit better and this is a bit more faded, so obviously it's a photocopy. Um, but, you know, everything else looks the same. One major difference that you can see here is they both say Sherbert Pink. However, the Sherbert Pink on this one is a light pink and this is hot pink with a black interior. Um, so that's definitely the first major difference. Now so let's get into the packaging. Um, the packaging pretty much is the same for both. Um, so inside you get this card, and inside the card I came, it came with um, what claimed to be an SGP um, screen shield. Now it was an anti-glare, and um, it was okay. It scratched pretty easily. Um, again, if you want to look back on my video of that, um, you'll see what I thought about that. So there's that packaging. And in this one, you also get um, a front and back, however, you get um, the real SGP front and back screen shield. And having never used SGP screen shields, like the real ones before, I was blown away. I have it on my phone right now, I'll show it to you, but it comes with a front and a back a um, and a cleaning cloth. And they're amazing. Let's just start by taking a look um, at the plastic frame. Obviously the color is different, um, but as you can see, all the cutouts are the same. Um, the, this, the fake one actually feels a bit stiffer and a bit um, firmer. This one's definitely squishier, um, but overall the frame, the frame is the same. I mean, there's not much difference. The big difference comes in the silicone. Now this silicone is really flimsy. It's, um, it's, it's linty, it catches lint, it's it's not good quality. This is, this is, it feels different. It's like a TPU, I guess. I think that's what they claim it to be. And it's a bit firmer, um, so it doesn't slip on and off. Like this one I found was really saggy on the bottom. It got stuck in my pocket a lot um, and what have you. So let's just kind of look at um, the buttons here. Now this button, the button on the real SGP it's just better quality, the covering of it. Um, the plus and minus is kind of imprinted right into it, whereas this one's like painted on and I can see it coming off um, in time. Same with the top. I mean, the cutouts are good, but this button is just painted and it's just going to come off a lot easier, probably. Um, so yeah, as you can see, the quality of the SGP one, the silicone is just better and I'm sure it'll stand up. I can see this, you know, ripping and breaking. So the fake one is going to go on my fake iPhone 4. Haven't really done much in reviews on this, but um, this one was always kind of difficult to get on um, because of the looseness um, of the silicone. So what always worked for me was just putting the bottom in first and then kind of peeling the buttons on and then just kind of massaging it into place because this silicone is like really loose. Let me just make sure it's seated. I think that's good. So there's that one. Now I do have the SGP um, ultra crystal screen shield on the front of this and having never used um, SGP the real one before this is 
phenomenal. Now I see what all the YouTubers are talking about when they say that SGP has the best screen shields on the market. It's not anti-fingerprint, but something about it kind of decreases the fingerprints on it. It's so crystal clear. It's it's like you don't even have a screen shield on. The cutouts are perfect. It fits perfect. Um, I do have an anti-glare on the back because I botched the back one, but it does come with a front and back. And you guys, like no joke, I mean, to buy this case, you get the front and the back, and that's your money's worth um, to begin with. Um, so this silicone is obviously a bit firmer, easier to put on. Um, this case definitely is easier to put on, starting with the buttons first and then working your way just kind of pull it over. I'm not doing this on camera, sorry. Pull it over the bottom. And um, it sits a lot better. It feels a lot better. First, um, the color. I love the SGP case way better. Um, but one of my big gripes is um, the color. I don't, I don't like this baby pink color, I guess. Um, that's why I bought this fake color because I like the hot pink and uh, the black better but that's just a silly thing I will probably end up getting a different color of this I like their new series that's coming out with the white interior to go with the white iPhone so it's an awesome case you guys I mean this is this is becoming my favorite case but let's do the cutouts here vibrate switch same buttons are in the same spot um, easy to press nice covered um, these ones are just painted on so I mean I think that'll eventually wear off the the coverings of these buttons are a lot nicer and then on the bottom there I think you can see there's SGP branding on the top same thing with this button it's painted um, but it'll just fade off it's fine um, headset headphone and secondary mic are uh, good cutouts easy to very small cutouts so you won't get a lot of really big DJ headphones in there but it is there's not much sorry not much material there so it might still work nothing on that side and then on the bottom you have three cutouts for the speaker microphone and dock and this is easily dockable because uh it's not recessed at all lay on the table obviously for front and back um because of that silicone obviously this SGP's quality is just better. I mean, this always got stuck and pulled and got linty. I mean, I like the look of these colors better, um, but this case, I mean, the quality is phenomenal. The screen shield, phenomenal. Um, it just feels great. I love bumper style cases. And so this, I mean, I would use this case every day if it weren't for um, the color. Um, but thanks SGP so much for sending this out to me. This was my first kind of official product sent to me for a review. And they wanted to see a comparison video and so there you have it. Um, so that is my review um, and comparison of the SGP Neo Hybrid uh, EX for the iPhone 4 and this is the fake of that that I picked up from Hong Kong so one more time SGP thank you so much I'll put a link to their um, channel in the undercarriage uh, their store so you can go pick this case up because it is phenomenal I've tried a lot of bumper cases a lot of cases and for somebody who loves bumper cases this is the case for me um, so thanks again thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed this video thumbs up makes the world a better place please subscribe if you haven't um, I do plan on having a giveaway in the very near future I've got product piling up and I would like to give back also leave comments below I've got a faithful few that do always comment and I appreciate it so much so comment I always respond and I will catch yay you got my subtle hint to stick around to the end of the video and you know why because I'm doing a giveaway. I am going to give away the fake and the real SGP um, Neo Hybrid uh, EX cases. So first prize will get the, the real one and second prize will get the fake. If the first prize person wants this fake one, which is just as good as you can see from the review, um, then great, we'll just figure it all out, whatever. Um, I used the screen shields um, from the packages and so I will be throwing in front and the back anti-glare um, screen shields from SW Box, awesome screen shields. Um, so that'll be the little goodie Wah, package. Yay, giveaway! I haven't done a review for a while. I'm finally getting this one up, so I thought, what better way to end the review than to do a giveaway? Rules are simple as always. Subscribe, it's right up there. Do the thumbs up, makes the world a better place. Leave a comment down below. I'll also put a link to my Twitter. If you'd like to follow me on Twitter and retweet out this giveaway, that would be great because the giveaway will end when we get to 250 subscribers. So I'm at 224 right now. Um, so 250 
is not too far away. 25 more subscribers. That's nothing. We can do it. Comment, rate, and subscribe. And that's awesome. I'm going to catch you guys all later. And cheers.